Now here's a final iteration of the uh, electronic speedometer project. Now just to confirm, this drill will run up to approximately 800 RPM. Marvellous. Now here's the Arduino connected to the stepper motor driver and the next 27 General Motors stepper motor. Notice the numbering there for the pins. 1, 2, 3, 4, anti-clockwise with the needle at the top. So there we go. And the device that's going to trip the Arduino so that we can uh, get the pulses onto the speedometer is here. That's the back end of a mini speedometer with an additional optical trigger you can see here. That was featured in the last video. So now the Arduino has been programmed to give 270 degrees sweep with a maximum RPM of about 1300 which is where I want to be. Now you can see the light flashing there. Finally, it's taking a while, it's doing it, bingo. Now theoretically these X27 stepper motors can be driven directly off the pins on the Arduino, but as I understand it there's a possible problem with voltage going back down the pins into the Arduino and generally doing it no good whatsoever. Um, so that's why I'm using this very cheap stepper motor controller. Less than ideal configuration because the control cables are coming out both sides. Um, what I've got to look at is the stepper motor. These pins are very fragile coming out of the back and they're also extending the thickness, of the depth of space needed to actually install this in as an alternative to the existing uh, speedometer needle. Uh, to speedo cable connection but it is very compact now if we can get around the problem with the uh, fragile pins on the back I think I might put some uh, glue gun glue between the pins and the uh, the body to stop them being bent but um, that looks like the, a working solution so finally got it I'll, uh, I'll post the code on YouTube for running this but it still is certainly a work in progress but the work nearly completed marvellous